The return of Buck Days is putting a lot of smiles on people's faces. It's also giving our tourism industry a much needed boost following last year's pandemic shutdown. Iran Hammy is in downtown Corpus Christi with more. Everybody's so excited to be out and about. I'm, you're seeing people starting to hug. It's, it's, it's you know, the, the, the fist bump starting to go away. The hug is starting to come back. The first weekend in May just might feel like the closest Corpus Christi has had to a normal weekend since the pandemic started. It's kind of a sense of getting back to normal. Um, like again, last year was really a hard year just for everybody in general. Um, but this year things are um, kind of starting to open back up. People are starting to come out. So that's a definitely a good thing to see. Buck Days is drawing in crowds from all over for everything that comes with it. The carnival, professional bull riding, rodeo, and wings over South Texas air show. But you've got more options in the sports, entertainment, and arts district. Harbor Playhouse is putting on their first audition play since the pandemic began. Local restaurants are lining up musical acts like Brewster Street Ice House. And right next door, Hurricane Alley is having 2019 attendance numbers. Thomas says an average of over a thousand people a day on the weekends. Last season was kind of a struggle for us just to get those numbers with COVID and all of that, but this year has definitely started off really good. What's this mean for Corpus Christi? We missed out on all of this last year. Oding says all downtown hotels being booked up should say it all. It's, it's very exciting to see everything coming back and everybody that's coming here, they spend money and that money is, is contributing sales tax dollars to the community. And so we're going to start to rebuild uh, everything that happened with COVID by having all these visitors come here. And if you still didn't get enough over the weekend, the Hooks take Whataburger Field on Tuesday for the first time in over a year. Reporting in Corpus Christi, Iran Hammy, Chris 6 News.